what, what do you think is happening of uh, any significance in learning and development right now? I think um, the biggest um, shift that we've been seeing in learning and development and I believe has the biggest power is the whole concept of digital learning because you know as we speak today everybody is on a smartphone everybody has access to the internet and you know and the attention spans of people are getting lesser and the content that you present to them on learning and development has to be thereby very engaging so I think um, uh, in an organization which is our size, which is 45,000 people, digital learning is one of the key contributors to solve any learning challenges because it enables you to have learning at your own pace. It enables you to have learning at an environment that you think you're comfortable in learning. And I think uh, digital along with blended, which is digital and classroom, makes a great combination. So we've tried that model and it totally works for us. And uh, I think um, in terms of learning, you know, one has to start thinking of it as a much more unconventional way. So we've really done a lot of things with theatre, with um, <coughs> art with music in fact in our induction program we take the entire um, organization values through a theater workshop and uh, we've just in fact um, started this year um, by doing a workshop on teamwork and collaboration where we actually had the teams play soccer so you went to a um, you went to a soccer ground you had jerseys teams played then you came back and then you debriefed about you know, what happened there you spoke about teamwork and collaboration and then you connected it to business objectives. So I think um, these crazy ideas about doing things experiential, um, kind of dabbling with unconventional learning methodologies which engage the learner where the learner actually uh, experiences um, the learning and then is able to apply it back to his work is are the biggest uh, game changers in learning and development.